John Singer Sargent, an American artist, had a life filled with interesting experiences that greatly influenced his artwork. Born in 1856 in Italy to American parents, Sargent lived in various cities throughout his life, including Paris, London, and New York. During his early years, Sargent traveled extensively throughout Europe, which allowed him to witness a multitude of different cultures and landscapes. These experiences opened his eyes to the diversity of the world, and he became fascinated with capturing the essence of different places through his art. In the early 1900s, Sargent embarked on a series of travels, capturing the beauty of cities like Evora and Avila. His paintings of these places, such as Evora and from Avila, showcase his ability to capture the unique architecture and atmosphere of each location. Sargent also visited Bethlehem, which led him to create the mesmerizing painting Church of the Nativity, Bethlehem. The artwork not only reflects his talent for capturing intricate architectural details but also demonstrates his interest in religious themes and the historical significance of the places he visited. One of Sargent's favorite places to paint was Venice, and he spent a considerable amount of time there. Paintings like Venetian Canal and Bridge and Campanile, Venice, allow us to glimpse into the enchanting beauty of the city's canals and architecture. These works highlight Sargent's skill in capturing the ever-changing light and atmospheric effects unique to Venice. Sargent's travels also took him inside various cathedrals, which inspired him to paint works like Cathedral Interior. These paintings showcase his ability to capture the grandeur and sacredness of these religious spaces, demonstrating his deep appreciation for their architectural beauty. Through his travels and experiences, Sargent developed a keen eye for capturing intriguing details, such as the Green Door, Santa Maria della Salute and the Venetian Doorway. These paintings demonstrate his ability to find beauty in the everyday surroundings and his skill in portraying the textures and colors of his subjects. Even in his sketches and studies, such as Sketch of Chelonis and Study for Death and Victory, Sargent's expertise in capturing human form and emotion shines through. These works offer us a glimpse into his process and his dedication to constantly improving his skills as an artist.